Hello, you're welcome. How to solve this nice exponential equation? Solution from here. From what we have here, this follows when we have a raised to power m plus n, which you can write as a raised to power m times a raised to power n. But this here we have 4 raised to power x times 4 raised to power 1, then plus 4 raised to power x equals to 180 on this side. That is, and what we have here, 4 raised to the power hex is common, and we factor it out. That is, 4 raised to the power hex into brackets, 4 raised to the power 1, that's d4, then plus 1 left here equals to 180 on this side. And here, this becomes 4 raised to the power hex times 5 here. Then equals to 180 on this side. Now this next step we divide both sides by 5 here. Divide this side also by 5. 5 cancelled each other on this side. And we are left with 4 raised to the power x equals to 180 over 5. Then here we can write this as 4 raised to the power x equals to 180 something as 5 times 36 then over 5 here that is from here 5 cancel each other and this becomes 4 raised to the power x equals to 36 then here we take the log on both sides and we have log 4 raised to the power x equals to log 36 from here then we apply the power law of logarithm when we have log m raised to power p p is same thing as p log m then what we have becomes x log 4 equals to log 36 then from here, we divide both sides by log 4. That is, divide here by log 4. Also, divide this side by log 4, which implies log 4 can each other here. We have x left, which is equals to log 36 over log 4 here. Then, from what we have here, we can express 36 as 4 times 9 then what we have becomes x equals to log 4 times 9 then over log 4 thank you for watching us at master t math class then from here this follows the law of logarithm when we have log a times b the same thing as log a plus log b that is what we have becomes x equals to log 4 plus log 9 then over log 4 that is from here we separate this into two fractions and this becomes x equals to log 4 over log 4 then plus log 9 over log 4 which implies here log 4 cancel each other we are left with 1 what we have becomes x equals to 1 plus log 9 over log 4 and also from here we can write 9 as 3 times 3, which is 3 square, and also 4 as 2 times 2, which is 2 square. Then here, this becomes x equals to 1 plus log 3 square over log 2 square. Then, from here, 
to apply the power law of logarithm again that is 2 comes here and also here and we have x now equals to 1 plus 2 log 3 then over 2 log 2 here that is from here to cancel each other and we have x equals to 1 plus log 3 over log 2 here and also from change of this when we have log a over log b we can rewrite this and this same thing as log a to base b then what we have here becomes x equals to 1 plus log 3 to base 2 so here we have the value of x here as 1 plus log 3 to base 2 now let's check if we satisfy this given problem that is from here we substitute the value of x which is x equals to 1 plus log 3 to base 2 then what we have becomes 4 raised to power 1 plus log 3 to base 2 then plus 1 here also plus 4 raised to power 1 plus log 3 to base 2 is equals to 180 on this side that is here we have 1 plus 1 and that's 2 so we can write it as 4 raised to power 2 plus log 3 base 2 then plus here we have 4 raised to power 1 plus log 3 base 2 is equals to 180 on this side that is here we apply the law of indices a raised to power m plus n same thing as a raised to power m times a raised to power m which implies here this becomes 4 square times 4 raised to power log 3 base 2 and plus also here we have 4 raised to power 1 times 4 raised to power log 3 to base 2 is equals to 180 on this side then here we can factor 4 raised to power log 3 base 2 out so we have 4 raised to power log 3 base 2 then into bracket 4 square left here plus 4 raised to power 1 is still 4 left here and is equals to 180 on this side that is from here we can express 4 here as 2 squared then raised to power log 3 to base 2 then multiply by 4 square here that's 16 then plus 4 then is equals to 1 or 80 from here that is this power multiplies and we can write it as 2 raised to power 2 log 3 base 2 then times here we have 20 is equals to 1 or 80 on this side then here we reverse this power from power law of logarithm then this becomes 2 raised to power log 3 square and base 2 times 20 is equals to 180 from here then from here this is the same thing as 2 raised to power log 9 to base 2 times 20 is equals to 180 from here then what we have here follows when we have a raised to power log b to base a which is equals to b that is here this is the same thing as 9 then times 20 is equals to 180 on this side and of course 9 times 20 here that is 180 which is equals to 180 from here left hand side equals to the right hand side hence here we conclude that x equals to 1 plus log 3 to base 2 satisfies this given problem and thank you for watching don't forget the steps
subscribe for more videos and turn the notification bell on. Share this video, give it a thumbs up, put your comments in the comment section. And uh, see you next class. Bye for now.